Well, people of the internet, remake here. I don't know if I'm streaming in the right category or with the right title, but hello. Today we're playing Outer Wilds because I started playing this on Friday and now I'm addicted. Um, also, I wasted so much time actually setting this up. I'm just turning around. Fuck. I don't want to be up there. I want to be down here. So, before I've concluded, I'll just curious and challenge to increase my heart temperature, my love. <laughs> Uh, Cassava tells me, me he and the construction yard crew have determined the, determined the power setting. We are not under any circumstances to go above. Okay, streaming out of wilds. I go zoomies for a space. Yes. So you stream elements is useful for something. I see. And am I right to think that consequently we'll be ignoring that setting? I can posit with nearly 100% certainty our friend ha friends have accounted for our nature, so I suggest we do. Um. Yes. Okay. The audio of the video capture device just isn't working now. Woo. And that's because I've got a mute output. Close. Can you, can you work? Okay. Well, you just aren't gonna hear the noises of the game. Um. But yeah. I'm just like ignore my writing. Given the orbital probe can and all the power it can structurally withstand, creates the greatest chances of finding the eye of the universe. Um, yes, the problem to travel as fast as it can, as far as it can, I'll make some adjustments. And now we've got Giant's Deep Projection Stone. I have bad news, Adams. Yero says there was a problem with the proposed power source, so the orbital probe cannon won't be asked to fire. I hope you're probably... I hope you're pulling my locomotive limb here, Cassava. I wish I were, my friend, but no. They're, they aren't certain they can fix the problem, so the orbital probe cannon is on indefinite hiatus. I'm sure I've already read this conversation. Tell Prevet and Mallow they should return from cannon. From the cannon, my spouse and I will remain at the construction yard for now. Yeah, I read this one. I read this uh, thingy. Oh, I can't remember what the place is. Oh, and I need to use this stone uh, here. What does this show me? This is the place I read it at. Yeah. I need to go here. I'm assuming this is where I got shot from. I'm assuming that's the construction yard. Now then. Zoom. Is this what this is supposed to look like? Ten minutes forty six seconds ago. Request to launch probe received from Ash Twin Project. Can aligned with randomly selected probe traje trajectory. Gravity field activated. Okay. Next place. Begin launch log. Orbital probe can launch request received. Probe launch successful. Probe tracking module is received. Data from the probe. One and orbital probe and an instruction compromised during launch damage to multiple modules detected. Yeah, one of these pieces is under the ocean. Wait, is this what it's supposed to look like? 
Up to probe cannon damage with plots of this structural stress detected assessing damage to modules. Control module intact no structural damage. Launch module viewport window fractured module exposed to vacuum of space. Probe tracking module missing. The probe tracking module, I believe, is the one that's under the water. So I've just been there. Zoom. And through here we go, and then... Uh, so this is the control probe tracking module which is gone. So yeah, that will be what's under. And then this is the control module which apparently has a broken windshield. God is destroyed in here. I want to see if I can get from get to this from the outside. Your level critical. I'll get more fuel when I go to my ship. If I get there in time. Requires I actually get to the ship. Uh, where is the hall? There it is. Zoom. So, get more fuel. Uh, no. Let's see. I can. You! Woo! I don't know what, why I yelled at you, but woo! This is what I could see from the thing! Oh, that's cool. I want. Ah, uh, no, I don't want to be up here! I just want that, and then I want to see what this does. Is this the other side? Yeah, this is where I've just been. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, and then control module in here. My little, my better 50%. I've already read this. The photo concluding I'll just curious the challenge and search increases my heart's temperature, my love. Telling me in construction yard, yeah, power, blah blah. Probe tracking module. Imagine private the probe tracking module will be the first to know the coordinates of the eye of the universe, you'll be the first to see them. I am honored and terrified. You won't ask the orbital pro can to use two so much private bricks, will you? Fret not, my nervous friend. We only need to fight the probe, probe once. Anyway, so who minds if it compromises the orbital probe and then structural integrity, slight, integrity slightly? 
Privet, I would mind, Mala. I would mind, because we won't be capable of receiving our probes data if the prob tracking module is destroyed. Okay, and then... Um... Is it this? This is... Oh, this is the orbital probe. Not the orbital probe. The probe tracking one. That's under the water. It's a tree. Um... If I can't do the ball thing in here. Eh? What led to it deciding there was enough trees to replenish my oxygen here? This place is literally a vacuum. We can't go back through it either. I have to go back out of the window. For which I say zoomies. I can at least hit the window. Yeah, and the other one's supposed to be there, and it just isn't. Yeah, this looks really cool. Zoom. Nope. Okay. And then... Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know. If, I think those are 22 minutes things. I don't think I did anything necessarily wrong. But I mean, that was just the end of the time on it. Yeah. You have no clue that I've already taken off like more than 20 times in this thing. You think I'm still a noob. Zoom. Why do I walk so slow? Bonk. Um, where am I going? Actually, it'd probably help if I check my not thing. Um, so yeah, I've seen all the modules for that. So, what's left on this thing? There's the Southern Observatory, and then there's the Ocean Current Discovery. What's this? No, I have an observatory. Measured a module of giant speed that revealed how an object might sink below the strong ocean current. Okay, and then, notice that to build a larger, more sophisticated ice sinking locator on grip will hold a soft pull. There are two paths beneath the little hollow surface that lead to the observatory. One starts at the gravity cannon, and the other starts at the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. There's a door to the observatory on the surface, but it's broken. So, this is brittle hollow. Um, 
to go to the Southern Observatory. Wait, wait. I think the thingy moons though. You know, the one that appears and disappears on random occasions. Is it here? Was it just on my map? Well, whatever it was, it isn't here anymore. Let's go. Where? I think the moon's the one of the thingies where if you don't look at it, it disappears. Okay, let's grab her. Okay, so where are the two paths for this? Um, Southern Observatory. Two paths between Brittle's hollow surface that lead to the observatory. One starts at the gravity cannon, the other starts at the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. I think the gravity cannon was somewhere around here. I'm sure I saw it. That is the thingy I have went too far. That is the moon. The moon is not useful to me. Fuck you, moon. Oh, surface integrity is 100% here. That's nice. There's nothing around here. There's a hole that leads to a black hole there, so I should probably be careful. Oh, service integrity is 42%. 67. I don't know what this is. Oxygen tax refilled. Okay, what's this? I don't know what this is, and that's a long drop. I want to be in there. What is this place? But if you find Tower of Quantum Knowledge, woo! If you're preparing to make your first pilgrimage on Quantum Moon, descend the steps to the entrance below. The knowledge held within will. Help you on your journey.
So an observatory is 550 miles, I think I said, but that is a black hole, so I'm not going in there. So I've got a knowledge below 90 meters. And that'll make you take me up. Oh, this goes into the black hole, doesn't it? No? Wait. You're welcome to this place above your sense of quantum knowledge. If you're making your first pilgrimage to the quantum moon, send these stars and obtain the lost knowledge you need for your journey. Zoom. Wait. Oh, yeah, you um, take pictures of things. And then they disappear and reappear, and it's a whole shenanigan. Where is that the bit? No, because that isn't moving. This place is strange. What's this? The crossroads. Um, I wonder where I'll end up. Um... Zoomies? Oh, Raybeck's behind here. Hey, Matt! How are you? Oh, you launched that script drop, you. Um. Can I tell him I learned something? No, from time somewhere outside the solar system, and there must have been trouble and watch the escape pod. What kind of trouble? Um, from the city. How did they hit the sand out? See you later. I am not saying I just want to refill this and then No, going down there is not a good idea. The fuck?
entire areas of this place fall. The actual fall. Okay, how would you get No, there's no way to get up there. I'm very confused what I'm doing here. Um, I, just, I need to be up there. Google is not going to help me. I thought that there was an uh No, I don't want to fall down there. Right. I thought that there was once an entire civilization down here, though. Like, they were just living alongside the black hole. And they utilised it, too. They just went, okay, we need fast travel to our space station. Let's use the black hole. Okay, what is that clock area? Um... Hanging City. Gravity Crystal Workshop. Gravity Cannon. Okay, so that is the Gravity Cannon. Yeah, hanging city. Ah, oh, shit. I didn't realise that path ended halfway across. I thought that was the full one. Okay, so let me find the other skate pod. Because I've only found two of them.
So. I got a new thing, Terra Quantum Knowledge. Okay, so I got everything on this thing. So then there's Southern Observatory and Outer, not Outer, Outer Ocean Current. Then there is Statue Workshop. I still need to figure out how to get into that. And we've got the Quantum Moon. High Energy Lab. The Ash Twin pro Project. We've got the Sun Station. We've got the Anglerfish Fossil, which I need to go and check out as well. Uh, we've got the Shelter Site, which... Not my survivors are crashing through a hollow climb to the cliff. Shelter Site before the surface. Which I'm assuming is going to be the Hanging City. Um, and then Lake Fed Cave. Not my earliest. Mysteriously vanished from a cave at the bottom of the dry lake. Had it under Twins North Pole. And then we've got Terra Quantum no Knowledge. Yeah, so. Um, I want to mainly do the Slight Gravity Cannon. What about the Gravity Cannon am I looking to? Oh yeah, the Interloper. Wait, I can call that home? Wait, Ember Twin. There's a Gravity Cannon on the Ember Twin, and I can call thingy home to it. Shit, yeah. I should probably put the suit on because otherwise I'm going to forget and that is always an amusing time but I don't feel like doing that at the moment. This is just a nice view. And then pressure goes down. And then spinning. What are you? Oh! You no longer exist. I'm assuming you're the quantum moon. I actually want to look around this area because there is quite a bit. And drop down. Okay, so that's been drowned at the moment. So, okay, this is the escape pod. This is a house. Church research notes. Property of church. Clearly no man will make an astronomical observations here. They chose an excellent spot. They had to have buildings anywhere. What is this big rotating device for? What was no man observing? I'd posit there's something special about the orange symbol on that device. How long the new astronauts translate a tool would be nice to have handy about now. Ooh. Pick cook scroll. Put scroll in hole. I would like your fuel. Um
Do you have hole? You do not have hole. Can you have hole? Are oh, you moved to where the planets are? None of you have hole. This plant sometimes and only sometimes has a moon. This is also of note. It disappears if no one is watching it. Isn't that fascinating? Orbital characteristic. I found your note, Mollera. Mollera. I can only count me among this moon's admirers. What is happening when it disappears? I doubt it ceases to exist. Do it move to another location? This is my first time encountering an actual satellite with the ability to vanish when not being watched. We should study it. Or even better, we should travel there. I agree. Our first step would be to de determining a method of traffic tra tra to track this phenomenon, this phantom moon, so that we can always know where it is. Given its reluctance to move while consciously observed, it might be a form of macroscopic quantum mechanics. I believe no I believe so. Not only does the moon appear around Brittle Hollow, it can confirm it I can confirm it sometimes of its timber hearth as well. So it's the occasional moon. Zoom. Yeah. So Boop. Yeah, and this tracks the planets. Oh, this is cool. Why? Why is this one orange? Where is this the? Is this for the moon? Yeah, it's the moon. Oh, that's amazing. That is actually amazing. They have a thing that tracks the moon. Do you have anything I can stick this in? No. Oof, that's sad. Honestly, I chose the worst point in time to be coming here to try and find the gravity cannon. Because at the moment, this planet is sand. But I did find something new. You can have this back. You know, I think I've explored more of the inside of this than I have the outside. Uh. Um, the fuck is going on here? 
I don't even know whose ship this is. Eh, that don't matter. Okay, back in here to try and find the cannon. I am just gonna fly around this planet until I find it. Which I think that is it. Um, Where? It actually worked. I have to fit the gravity cannon. Call the shuttle home. So I'm gonna see. You the fuck are these seats? Hello? Are you dead? My first situation is maybe dire. Pipok and I landed here on this comet not long after its arrival in the star system. Our shuttle's equipment has strange energy readings coming from somewhere beneath the surface. Pie and Poke were able to locate a fissure in the ice and on the comet's sunward side and they descended inside in to investigate the source of the reading. But Pi and my sister have been gone for a long time now. They haven't contacted me uh, since descending below the surface either. Should I leave the shuttle to look for them? I want to follow protocol, but I don't know what I'll do if they aren't well. Look. Hi, come back to me safely, my friends. I. They're robots. Well. I'm not even sure, there's bones. Are you a robot? Clothing. This is fitting. Then there's bones and there's clothing and I don't know what's going on. The fuck did I just do? <laughs> did I just crush a spaceship? Yeah, I crush a spaceship.
Oh, see, I'm not sure what the fuck I'm actually trying to figure out. I just want to know what is the... Like, composition of genetics and the... Normai or whatever call? Because... I've seen skeletons, but then I've also seen, like, the robot things. I want to know, are they, like... Organic beings that had like robot companions, or were they robots, or did they have robot endoskeletons? Like, the fuck is going on? Quantum Moon, Terra Quantum Knowledge, Quantum Moon Locator. Sun Station. What was the other thing that I started? Ashram Project. Station Workshop. How oh, was this? Sun Observatory. Shots Cam. The Bed Cave. Energy Lab. So, Zoom. Flying around on this is just fun. Zoom. <laughs> okay. Um. So, and then we'll get this. No then. What's up? Velocity matched.
you don't exist in like a physical way. Oh! Wait, am I in the dark bramble? No. Where the fuck am I? I found something. No, I'm not messing with that. I'll trash it. I am here after watching you wander the skies for so long I'm about to stand for the first time on the quantum moon. As expected, my shuttle has landed on the moon's south pole. I will make the remainder of the journey on foot. We don't know why the quantum moon always welcomes its visitors on the South Pole, but just that it is true. As a child, I considered such a non-sinister. Now, though, I understand they bear no ill will. The universe is as we are. I am ready. There is nothing in this one. Wait, they built something on the moon? Hang out. Wait. What did they have? They show which one the moon's at. So those are the twins. Timber. Uh, I can't remember the name of the motherfucker. It's the one that's got nothing inside. Then the water boy. The dark bramble it's currently at. And then... What's the other one? It isn't following the comet, is it? We call the room of quantum entanglement. You have recalled the rule of quantum Im imaging. We call the rule of the sixth location. I don't know what two of those are. I think I skipped a chapter in this book. But we're just going to leave that. Time to play on the moon. Okay, that's my ship. What's the ship? Wait. Is that the one I've already been to? Yes, it is. No, I'm gonna go to the other pole. Oh. Hello. You're dead. How did you die? I do not know. I assume someone stopped looking at the moon whilst you were here. 
So is that just a helmet? Because you're born. Wait. That... That's mine. God, this is messing with my head. The fuck? Where's the body? Okay, that's my thing. But then if... There's a jellyfish in here? Wait, is this how those species are travelling? Is this how there's an anglerfish on the thingy? That okay. Okay. Now then. The stress beacons. Okay, so... Okay... Ah, oh, shit. Oh, hello. But the you're moving tall isn't scary at all. Um... Somewhere around this area, I guess?
There's no lights in this direction though. So I'm probably just going towards nothing. Wait, is that where it is? Let's get pulled free. I should probably refill that. And then... Oh, skip pod crashes. We tried to flee this place, showing our movement and communication capabilities in the process. We've held out as long as we could here, but this pod supply of breathable air is nearly depleted, and the anglerfish attacks more and more frequently. Our best chance of survival is to return the to the vessel to either repair the damage or move probably away at rescue. Second, is the message finished? Ah, where's the message? Ah, it's up here. Message finished, the vessel's beacon is already... Ah. Growing fainter, it will be gone in a matter of hours, we need to leave here quickly. Begin flight log. Escape pod three has been mortally injured. Energy sequence activated. Awaiting departure from vessel. Ah. I don't want to take pictures. Multiple collisions have already altered pod's trajectory. Significant damage pod detected. Scanning external environments. Scan complete. Gravity not detected. Navigating life support error. Propulsion error. Scan completed. Gravity is not detected. Rebel error not detected. Multiple life forms detected. Potentially hostile. Verdict. Do not exit pod. Please don't say that they exit pod. Well, they will eventually. Okay, so that's where we came in. Hello. Have I read? Ah. That's not what I wanted to do. There's a new problem. Our equipment is detecting two distant beacons from the vessel, but it isn't possible. Ah, fuck you. There's a new promo equipment beacons, but it isn't possible for vessels to be in two different locations at the same time. I agree, but the beacons are exactly identical to each other, perhaps if I had more time. We're nearly we're nearly out of time already, and the vessel's beacon is quick the vessel's beacon is quickly fading soon, it will be gone and we will be lost. We will follow the beacon who source the nearest to us. But suppose that beacon is false. We likely don't have enough air to reach the father of the two beacons, and this decision is made. We'll leave the trail of lights as we go. There's still a little chance someone could hear it or escape pod's distress signal. Wait, is that why all the seeds are lit up? Which way up is the ground? This way, apparently. Um. 
let me just emergency scare patch bonk No, these are the lights that they left. Oh, they ended up at one of these. So any who come searching for us, we followed one of the two beacons in the vessels to this place, but now can go no further. It's almost too faint to hear now, but the vessel's beacon is still faintly emitting from him within this phony seed, yet the opening is too small for even a single nomad to fit through it, so a skate pod couldn't have flown through here. I don't understand how this could be possible, but this gruesome place seems to be able to manipulate space itself. Maybe this was our undoing. To avoid... To be so close to the location of the vessels and still be so far is difficult. Worse, the vessel's beacon is dying soon. We will be unable to hear it. There is nothing we can do now but try to perhaps find a way inside or at least attempt to comprehend why this is happening. My dearest hope is that some that the other escape pods were able to reach relative safety. They started entire societies. And you have been here, who I assume has been thousands of years. At least hundreds, probably thousands. And you know what? I'm gonna join you because I can't be bothered going back to the ship. Bonk! Oh, come on! At least spike my suit. Hello. You were still trying to get through. No, people like you, you just spent your last moments together. Zoom. Yeah, that was the out loud. Without any context as to what I was doing, what we were searching for, or why I was here. And I'm not going to give you any more context either. Thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye. Um, yes, that does seem like an abrupt ending, but um, it's almost nine o'clock because I forgot that I actually need to stream today.